Hi, I'm Nate Harbin with AY McDonald, and today I'm here to show you how to relubricate our plug valves. For starters, I want to introduce our actual relubrication tool, which as you'll see on, it, on the end, we've got an Allen wrench, which is what the plug at the end of the core is. So we're going to remove the plug and then take our tool, load it with a grease cartridge, and while I'm spinning this down until I see some grease, I want to quickly just talk about a couple reasons why you would relubricate a plug valve. For starters, would be age. If it's out in the field for 20, 30 years, and you need to throw a little bit more grease into it for that gas tight seal. Second is if it was purged incorrectly and the grease was blown off the core during the purge procedure. So we need to actually apply additional grease at that time. And the third is just the actual application of the valve. If it's a valve that is getting cycled multiple times uh, frequently, it could need and require additional relubrication of, with additional grease. So I'm going to spin my tool on. It's in. So now what I'm going to do is spin and push our grease into the core. And when we're doing that, we're going to do it until we feel resistance. Now the reason that we're going to feel this resistance is the grease has been pushed on, onto the core. Our core actually has lines on, on it that the grease follows as a track. So I'm filling up that core and that's pretty good resistance, which again is an indicator that we've got grease fully on our core. As you see, we're doing this while in service. Simply spin the tool off and our plug going back in does not require any additional sealant. All right, once again, I'm Nate Harbin, and if you found this video helpful, give us a like, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and follow us on social media. Thanks for watching.